Uh, oh, a shockwave. We don't have a shockwave yet. Spirit bomb is fucking awesome. Card, it's 35. Power, which is a lot. <laughs> Kaio taught to Goku. Take energy. <laughs> That's it. But we do not have a shockwave yet, which we need one. This is the thing that makes me it so that I can avoid, say, Nappa's Nappa slasher or whatever. So, uh, we gotta take this because we don't even have one yet. We need it. Yeah, we gotta take the shockwave. He's still alive. Almost to Roshi's house, Gohan. Yes. What's that? We came that way. Is it a star? No, it doesn't look like a star. What the? I sense a strong key. Doesn't feel like my dad's key. Something's wrong, I can feel it. It's too strong. What's going on? Dad. I'm going back. Huh? Going back? You mean to Goku? Dad is in danger, I can tell. He could- he could lost! But even if we go back... Yes, I know, but... I have to go. Hey, wait, Gohan, I'll go too. Gohan and Krillin return to Goku. And they saw... Holy shit, it's a giant monkey! Dad. No, he turned into a monkey! Piccolo destroyed the moon, but... Yo! Whoa, you're Yajirobe! Also known as the Slayer of Nappa. It's okay, I know him. What's happening? That monster? I know, it's Vegeta. What? Time for a miracle, the Saiyan Gohan. Goban! Okay. If it's like the screen's flashing, it's just because I'm like tabbing out. Yeah, I don't think you should be able to see that. If we cut his tail, he'll revert back. His tail? Gohan, Yajirobe, get his attention. I'll cut his tail with a destructo disc. Let's go. They carried out. They carried out destructo disc. But. He dodged the disc. He he. You knew about my tail, but just wait. As soon as I beat Kakarot, you're next. See ya. Stop, stop. That's sick. No, how did I miss the other one? My tail. Gasp, gasp. The tail. I cut it off. We did it. He's back to normal. I can't take credit. Well, that's nice of you, Yajirobe. You don't have to be so humble. You won't get away with this. I guess you do want to lost. I'll make your wish come true. Gohan, run. Want to run, eh? Do it if you can't. Okay, hang on. Uh, I'm just consulting my memory real quick. First, could go a little bit down. You'll find Yajirobe's sword, then talk to Krillin. I've got to run fast. I'm supposed to find Yajirobe's sword somewhere. Go a little bit down and find Yajirobe's sword. Here? Is this a sword? I'll take it. Okay. Then talk to Krillin. This is just, I'm just going over stuff in my head. Gohan, when you're attacked with beam attacks, stay on the ground. You're an easy target in the air. It's the same in a real battle. Stay on the ground to reduce the beam attacks damage. The damage from a hit is reduced in the air, however. Am I clear? Yes, sir. Okay, use me as a decoy now. Run away. Yes. Next, find the Kyo card lying right to him. Oh, here? Oh, we got a free Kai. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I wouldn't, didn't need to waste that. Now we can talk to Yajirobe. It's my sword. Give it back. I can't... I can get caught so long as I have got this. Bye. He's gone, huh? What's this? Chiaotsu. Ooh. It's a useful card. Think you could run away, eh? I'm a nice guy, so I'll beat you next to your dad. How could you do such a thing?
Okay. Oh, whoops, I didn't read that. Uh, you sure lost hard, Kakarot. Still alive? Here's the plan. First, I finish Kakarot. His son is next, and Baldi third. Then one who cut my tail. Yikes, he didn't forget me. Lost, Kakarot. Vegeta attacks the frozen Goku. Gohan seeing his dad get pummeled. Stop it! What? I'll beat you! Um. Hmm. Oh, oh, I can choose to be Goku. Okay, well, we want to... Okay, okay. All right. <laughs> this is this... My memory My memory is saying that we can... We have to choose Gohan, and we'll unlock something later. I didn't even know you could fucking... I didn't even remember that you could play as Goku. I thought it was... I thought my memory was telling me you could play as Krillin. Okay. Deck. Okay, God, we have to edit this again, because we need to put Solid Shot back in. We need to take out... Um... Take out Bulma. We want to put in the shockwave, absolutely, just in case. It's something. Three stage attack. Don't need it. You can always do that and put in another dunk shot. Okay. We have our two endurances. We have our avoiding. Chaozu. We do want Chaozu is good, especially if Vegeta is faster than Gohan, which he might be. Hmm. Yajirobe is useful. Hmm. Shoutsu could give me two turns. If I'm slower. I think I'd be more likely to use Chatsu than Kaio. Than King Kai. So. Where are you, Chatsu? There you are. This is speed down. Only 60% accurate. Mm. Well, yeah. Okay. Alright. Okay. Let's do it. Do we get different music for this one? This is like the last fight of the Saiyan. No. <laughs> There's still the regular music. There's two battle musics in this game. <sighs> Okay, got Yajirobe right off the bat, that's pretty cool. And this is not terrible. He is faster than we are, so Chaozu could actually potentially be useful. We can move up. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, Vegeta. I mean, we did pretty well when we were using Goku. And Gohan's level 2, so I mean... Got a Foresight, that's not bad. Three stage, attack. BP up. We need the items that like lower their defense or increase our attack. Which would be nice. Okay. So, Vegeta will probably use like Gallic Gun. So... Probably want to draw on avoiding as soon as possible. Of course, uh, he's staying on the ground. But even if he gets onto the gets into the air, we have Yajirobe. I like the the sprite work for the uh, the close up sprites here, not the uh, <laughs> far away ones. Are well, I mean, you know, you can see it's an odd. Cho oh, please. Uh, okay, I'll take it. That's fine. It's something. I have I have defense. Let's see, I've got 20. We might as well gather power. We're gonna use dunk shot right away. So long, so long as he doesn't move. Okay, he moved. Okay. Hopefully, he just moved backwards. Good. Okay. And not backwards into the air, because I can, you know, I can just force him forwards again. 
Ooh, he's gathering power. <laughs> That's spooky. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm-mm-mm-mm. I don't like that. Okay, we have a second dunk shot that we can just pull out of our butt. And use this one. These are all good cards, so I guess I'll get rid of Continuous Punch. Don't block it. Good, okay. So we should do a pretty good amount of damage. Our, our strength increased too, but Vegeta probably has a decent amount of health. Okay, good. Good, good, good. One more close-up dunk shot like that, and he's, I think, done for. Okay, but... Oh, God, what's he gonna do? I think the safest move is to just move backwards onto the ground. Because, like, I mean, if I block his, um... If I use Foresight against his regular attack, that's great. But if I don't, then I take, like, you know, a little bit of damage. It's not that bad. But if I get blasted right where I am with a beam, with him increased power, that would be exceptionally bad. So I think the safest thing is just to move. Okay, he used Continuous Kick. Great. I mean, luckily it's not that strong. It's... that's 20. So... Yikes. Okay. Yikes. Okay. But, yeah, that did give me a decent amount of CP, and we do have Dunk Shot right here. So we could use this fourth stage attack. Keep Yajirobe, because he's, he's, that's 10 damage for only 4 cost, which is huge. Gotta get rid of an energy bomb. Yeah. Use four stage attack. A, A, B down. Squared off, okay. Ooh! Alright, okay, okay. Uh, okay, what do we do? What do we do? He might have a decent amount of CP, because I. He only used Continuous Kick, which is only 15. Oof, oof, oof. Do we play it safe? Let's play it safe. Okay, alright, I'm on the ground, I used Endurance, but I am pretty low health! But I would have absolutely died if I did anything else, so come on. Yes! Alright. Okay, he should be pretty low on CP. And even though I used 7, I should have gotten- I DON'T HAVE ENOUGH! No! No, I'm one short! Oh, that's- Okay, I got an avoiding, though. Continuous kick, I don't think, will beat him. I don't think so. No. If I three-stage attack, move forward. Dunk shot. He doesn't shockwave or endurance, then I think I've got him. He moved into the air, okay. That's not... Oh no, he didn't move into the air. Oh, he moved... Oh, he moved forward for me. Okay. He just used... He used 15, and I believe Gallic Gun's probably gotta be like 19 or 20. So he used a lot, so he probably doesn't have anything, so I can probably just... I'll just foresight. Okay, gather power. Alright, whatever. It's fine. I'm in the best position possible, though. Assuming he doesn't use Shockwave or anything like that. Which he shouldn't have that much CP, but it's not like he needs much to be able to use. I mean, we have to use Dunk Shot. Like, I mean... If we hit it, I'm pretty sure we win. So... Just hope he doesn't use Shockwave or Endurance. Eh. Oh, he moved. He moved up into the air. That could be bad. If they move up, if they move forward when they're already like that... Okay, we got him. Never mind. We're good. Sick. Okay, the game's being kind of nice. 
Okay, Tien after image or another avoiding is pretty huge. What does Tien do? Okay, Tien is a stronger but less accurate and more a higher cost Yajirobe. Don't think that's worth it, to be honest. Key cannon attack. Protect and guard. No clue. I know that things do different things and and if you use them in guard, but I don't know what protect and guard means. I could consult my memory real quick. Real quick, let me let me think about this. Let me, let me just consult my memory right here. Let me just see here. I'm thinking, I'm just gonna my brain real quick. Okay, my memory doesn't remember. My memory my memory is just is just saying the the same description that is on the screen right now. So sorry Tien, I think I'm gonna grab a second avoiding. Vegeta. Don't worry. I'll give you all a proper burial. What? That was quite a hit. I thought I was dead for sure. But I still have the strength to finish all of you. And when I'm done, I'll focus my power and wipe out this planet. No, I won't allow you to win. Take that. Gohan and friends were losing. But then, Gohan's tail reappeared. Gohan, Gohan. Yeah, Dad? Gohan, the sky. Look at the sky, at the ball, light, light ball in the sky. In the sky? No. <laughs> uh. Gohan, sweetie, are you awake? Mom? Where am I? Relax, we're on Bulma's plane. Long time no see. Hard day, Gohan? We survived. How? Is the Saiyan? He ran away. We lost him. How about Dad? You know, with the, with the lexicon this game has, we lost him could be interpreted as we killed him. But they actually did lose him... Well, I mean, they let him go. I, I, whatever. Behind you, Gohan. I survived, thanks to you. And Krillin, I remember you said that we can revive everyone. I don't know when Krillin told Bulma that. I guess off screen. What do you mean? Um, the Saiyans said Kami and Piccolo are aliens called Namakans. Namakan legend says there's Dragon Balls there. We may find them on that planet and use them to revive Piccolo. That's right. You know, and everyone else too, Gohan. I mean, come on. Piccolo's revival means Kami's revival too. That means, you know, revival from being lost, of course. That means Earth's Dragon Balls will return too. Huh, <sighs> sounds far-fetched. Where can we find that planet? Wait, I'll ask Kaio, leave it to me. He must know where it is. Kaio? He took care of me when I was dead. When you were what, Goku? Excuse me? Let me fix this. He took care of me when I was lost. Or rather, when I was beat. Kaio rules the northern galaxy, including Earth. He's even stronger than the protector of Earth. Thanks to Kaio, they found where Namek was. They also found it would take 4,000 years to reach it. Then they found Kami's spaceship. There was abnormal weather on Namek, and most of the, its inhabitants <laughs> lost a Namek who left using his space sh his ship headed towards Earth and eventually became the protector of Earth. His ship takes a month to get to planet Namek. Okay. Gohan, Krillin, and Bulma looking for the Dragon Balls left for Namek. 
Gohan, sweetie, don't forget to do your homework. Launch into space, the hope of Nemec. update my memory real quick. Okay. Gohan and friends arrived at Namek, but they weren't the only ones looking for the Dragon Balls. Vegeta was there along with an even stronger friend. <laughs> yes, I would describe Frieza as a friend called Frieza. Frieza attacked Namekan villages, stealing their Dragon Balls. Gohan and friends rescued a kid from Frieza's attack. Led by this Namek child, Krillin met Guru, who held the last Dragon Ball. We're skipping a whole lot of stuff, huh? Okay, can I survive on a planet like this? I feel helpless. You'll be fine. Your dad is... Did he... <laughs> no, your dad is coming here too, right? No, Bulma's dad is not coming. Your dad is coming, Gohan. <laughs> I don't know how what good... Um, uh, Dr. Briefs would be on Namek. I mean, he's really smart, but, you know. That's right. Goku looked- or maybe- who knows, maybe in this story, Goku is- is, uh, Bulma's, uh, father. Goku looked for the Saiyan ship he rode in as a baby. He had it rebuilt. And it can reach Namek in six days. <sighs> if only our ship wasn't destroyed. We could have- hey, Gohan! The Dragon de Ball Detector moved. Maybe because of Krillin? That must be it. He must have found a Dragon Ball. Wait a minute. Those five belong to Frieza. So who is this one, then? It's coming from the village that Vegeta attacked. But I don't sense Vegeta's key. Ah, he attacked the village, but he couldn't find the Dragon Ball, even with the Dragon Ball radar that he apparently has. I'll go get it. Ooh, we get some different music. Get some old Game Boy Color classic music. Oh no, the whole village is ruined. It must be Vegeta. I must find the Dragon Ball. Radar shows it, shows it in the direction of the lake. Okay. Okay, when there. I don't think this is the right area. Radar shows it. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to talk to one of these houses. Dende! That's a really useful card. Okay. Okay, let's see. There it is! The Dragon Ball! Maybe I should go back to Bulma? Want to go back? Um... Yes. Apparently that's it. Hey, seems like someone's here. Did you destroy our village? Huh? No, it wasn't me. So why do you have the Dragon Ball? Um... Uh... You did it. Get ready to lose. The Namakans began to attack. Right or left? Okay, so this is just according to what I what I remember, my memory. We can get different cards here. Okay, so pretty sure if I chose a defeat deck, if I choose left, then I can get an endurance, which would be useful. Or if I choose right, then I can get after image. Which is, I'd rather have an endurance. So, left? What? My attack was dodged. No, listen, I didn't do it. So, what happened? What happened was. I apologize for mistreating you. No problem. But you dodged my attack. You must have a strong master. Yes, I do. This is for you. Hey, that's three endurances. That's pretty good. Do you remember. Did you remember to increase your parameters? You won't become strong unless you do that. I won't forget. Who are you? <gasps> I don't have time to talk now. A? I think we'll see each other again. Someday. Farewell. He's gone. I must go back to see Bulma now. That was apparently Nail, but I wonder why it was there. Hmm. 
The villagers hit it, maybe? Somebody's coming. It's Vegeta's key. I've got to do something. Go on, hit the Dragon Ball, and left it. Just as I thought, Kakarot's son. What? You've got the Dragon Ball? Your bald friend gave it to me. What? What did you do to Krillin? He's alive. Thank me for that. I got them all! Let's celebrate! Vegeta has caught all the Pokémon! All? Is he the one who hid that ball? I'll live forever and conquer all! Instead of Frieza. So he isn't on Frieza's side, even though he's he's his friend, of course. Vegeta was just using- or no, Frieza was just using me. But they'll work for me now. So, is Kakarot coming here too? Um... No! He didn't know you'd come here. I see, that's too bad. We three are the last Saiyans. You'll have to tell Kakarot back on Earth. Oof. I'll go to Earth soon enough and finish you along with the entire planet. See ya! Ouch, ow, ow. Our Dragon Ball wasn't damaged. Let's hurry and see Bulma. Oh boy. Gohan joined with Krillin and found a place to hide. Bulma and the Dragon Ball were hidden elsewhere. Gohan and Krillin then went to see Guru. Guru has the power to unlock hidden potential. Gohan! Dende, is that Guru? I'm Nail. Guru is inside. Yes. Are you Gohan? Nice to meet you. Guru touched Gohan. Uh... Gohan was filled with power. Oh. Power up complete. <laughs> Vegeta sensed Gohan's power. What did you do? Why has your power increased so much? Guru said something is approaching us. It's Goku. Goku's finally came. Goku finally came. I don't think so. It's not alone. No, it's the Ginyu's. It's Ginyu's special forces. I'm just as confused. What? They're Frieza's strongest men. Vegeta knew the forces and said, Only one way out. Make me immortal and beat them all. You took the ball I hid, didn't you? Give it back now. Any other choices? I promise you, I won't hurt you when I'm immortal. We didn't come here for this. Namek Dragon Balls grant three wishes. You may get your wish too. Three? I thought it was one wish. Hurry, or it'll be too late. Okay, follow me. But I want you to keep the, your, the promise. Seven Dragon Balls were... Brought to Vegeta. Then. Hiya, Vegeta. Whoa. I didn't notice them coming. Are they... Raccoon! Berter! Jice! Guldo! Ginyu! We're Ginyu's special forces. Darn. Dragon Balls, huh? I'll take those. Gohan's resistance failed, and the Dragon Balls were instantly taken. Well, good job, Gohan. I'll bring these to Frieza. The winner of a game of Janken, which is like rock, paper, scissors. I don't know why they didn't translate that to rock, paper, scissors. Will fight Vegeta. Next winner takes care of those two. Do we really have to fight? They're too fast. We can't run. Rats. So I get the little ones. Do it quickly. They're annoying. Alrighty. Is this a game to them? Krillin! And we got another four-stage attack. Sick. Okay. Uh, okay, but according to my memory, we want to still be Gohan, which is good because he's higher level. Um, deck. Okay, we want to get rid of... We got another... We got... Hmm. What do we want to get rid of? Maybe... I guess the after image, so I don't really use it. That four stage attack in there. 
And I got another Endurance, which is definitely useful. I think maybe we'll get rid of Energy Bomb. It's pretty low damage. I guess. Put our third Endurance in there. Because we want to draw a defense card, like, as soon as possible. Uh, get rid of Continuous Punch at some point. I think this is pretty good, though. Yeah, Jirobi is to get them in position and to just do some free damage. 100% accurate, right? Yeah, sick. Yadirobi is great. Okay. Yeah, it has basically a cheaper continuous punch that can't be blocked. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think that's it. Alright, this will probably be the last fight that I do. Okay. I am Gohan, right? Yeah, okay. And what are Gohan's stats? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's do this. I mean, it's just Goldo, right? I mean, come on, right? Uh. Okay, we already got a five stage, or four stage attack. So that's good. Go ahead and use it. Forward, A, A, B. Ooh, that was close. Okay. Yeah, generate that CP. Okay. We got Chaozu, which is useless because we're faster. We got Yajirobe, and we got a... Okay, alright. Okay, if we do Dunk Shot, that'd be pretty good. Ooh, we did, but he's a little further away. So I kind of want to move in close. We'll gather power. We'll, we'll save that Dunk Shot for a, a rainy day, because we have enough if we just gather power. Battle Jacket. Guard power. Oh! That's, that blows. Damn, well, we definitely want to hit him when he's close now. Okay. Oh, hang on now. Three stage attack. That's fine. No problem. All right, now we want to blast him. Ooh, what do we draw? Avoiding. I think that's good. All right, let's dunk on him. Just don't move. Or guard, or do anything. Just stand there. Good. Don't block it. Don't you do it. Good. It still did a pretty good amount of damage. It basically ne negated my power increase from the level up, essentially. Okay. I'm gonna back off. Oh yeah, by the way... Um, if the enemy is closer to you, then you you will still get a little bit more time to do the input command. Not as much time as if um, you were the one who was moved forward. Um, but I think instead of 1.2, you get 1.7. Chouts is going to be useless, so. so we're faster. A, B, A, up. That's right, stay right where you are, Goldo. I like you being right there. I did knock him upwards, but that might not actually do that. It did. Okay, well, we can just use Yajirobe to knock him down, so it's not that big a deal. Just gonna guard. Three stages attack. He's not gathering power, but I mean, like, if we can, if we can get enough stuff to blast him, just like... Before he even can do shit. I mean, I have avoiding. 
So that's pretty sick. Energy beam, okay. Useful thing if he's just a little bit, uh... Hmm. We have the dunk shot, right? Yeah, we do. So a three-stage attack would get me in range to do that. Could also gather power, but there's not much point because I have both of these skills just in my deck. So we are just going to use a three-stage attack. Get rid of Continuous Punch, because we have Yajirobe. Okay. Okay, alright, well he's going to get an extra turn now. Oh great, so now Chiaotzu actually could have been useful. <laughs> great. Okay. So we're going to have two defensive turns right here. I'm going to move forward. Okay, he's still not gathering power, which is great. I mean, admittedly, that's pretty awesome. I might actually just use Energy Wave. He's in the air. He increased his... his physical, or his defeat. Defense. And I'm just gonna guard. He's probably gonna gather power now. Yeah? Okay. Hmm. Got another continuous punch. I wish we had Kamehameha, that'd be great. So we'll leave him with 12, which is a decent amount. I might just be able to use Yajirobe on the next turn and just blast him that way. This won't kill him. But I think it's gonna do good damage and then I can Yajirobe him. Yeah, hopefully he doesn't... If he, if he blocks, it's not a big deal, because it's not that costly. I'll still have a lot. Okay, he moved. Okay, that's... Oof. Yeah. Oh, damn. All right, well... Okay, shit. What is he gonna do? Is he gonna go for it right away, or is he gonna... the ground. I don't know. He has a lot of key. He has a lot. I'm gonna go for it. Shit! Okay, well... Damn it. Alright, whatever. Okay. Well, we know what we're doing next turn, unless we draw Endurance. Which we did. Okay. Well, we're just gonna... We just gotta build up CP, or CC now. Okay, 40B. That's not going to help, Goldo. You already are faster. You're not going to get another turn, but I appreciate you wasting your CC. Okay. Alright. Alright, alright, okay. Well, we definitely want to use an Endurance, because he's going to use something. He's going to absolutely use... Yeah, Telekinesis, okay. Sick. Beep. Yeah. Easy. No problem. We get another endurance. Shockwave. I don't think it's going to be used too terribly useful against Goldo, but I guess I'd rather have something than just using guard. Uh, continuous punch. Wait, why would we do that when we have Yajirobe? Yeah. Just need to build up CC. That's all there is to it. ABB. Oh, you son of a bitch! I forgot to add Dende to my- Oh no! 
that was the card I forgot. Dende does that same thing, and it's healing. Oh no. We're gonna move back. Yeah, he's going for it again. Back up. <laughs> oh jeez. I mean, luckily, it's not that strong. And if I stay in this good position, that's not so bad. Two Yajirobis, that's that's 20 damage for an 8 CC cost. Essentially. I'm just gonna keep gathering power. I'm gonna get rid of this. I don't think it's a great idea. But I'm gonna do it. Because I don't think Goldo's gonna use physical attacks. A down. I, I, Goldo, what are you do? I mean, again, I appreciate you wasting your CP, but... Goldo is fast. Gotta use Foresight. Maybe he'll do it. Okay, alright, we'll block. Get the fuck out of here. <sighs> okay. I kind of want him to use a big strong attack and then just get him on the crack back. Yeah. So I think... We'll just keep getting CC. So that we have enough to maybe guard. And enough to, uh... Okay, move forward, alright. It's good for us this turn, because we'll do a little bit more damage. It's in the... Air. I don't like that. We can knock him down. We can knock him down. We're fine. And we, we yeah, we want to endurance. Telekinesis. Okay. We're far back. We're gonna guard. This should not do, like, much at all. Okay, yeah. We're fine. That life increasing thing. Really dirty move. Okay, yes, let's let's Yajirobi. Get him, Yajirobi. Boom. Okay. Alright. If I dunk shot him at the he's dead. He's absolutely dead. I think I can even stay back here and he'll Mm, but what if he uses Endurance, though? Can move into the air, in case he uses Continuous Kick. I think if he uses Telekinesis, regardless... Uh, well, if I stay back here, I... No, I don't think I would live. I don't think he has telekinesis anymore. I don't think he has enough. He used it twice, and he's used, like, his his telepathy, like, three times. I don't think he has that much CC. <sighs> he might use, like, a continuous... I don't think he has enough for that, though. If he has a continuous punch or energy bomb, I think I'll survive anyway. So we will move... Here. Okay, five state. Okay, so it probably would have been better to go into the air, but that's okay. Why don't I have a five state attack? Not fucking fair, man. Okay. Okay. He could, he could shockwave or endurance this, which is scary. We got a dunk shot. Hopefully he doesn't do anything. Come on, don't be cheating, rotten bastard AI. Oh, he moved. Okay, that could change things. I'm glad I moved forward. Come on, kill. Yes! Got him. It was touch and go. Continuous kick, Kayo, or a scouter. Ooh. Guard down. Ooh. Ooh. That is our first technically attack increase. So.
Yeah, we're absolutely going to take the Scouter. Yikes! Hey, Golda, lost! This is bad. Losing one of our members means we can't make cool fighting poses. We'll have to ask Genyu to invent a new pose for four. Well, anyway, let's decide who fights by Jonkin. Are they idiots or something? It's going to be rough from here. Well, Vegeta, it's our turn now. Humph. Hey, you two. You should help Vegeta, too. You're toast! Raccoon's attack. Strong and evil. Let's see, let me check here. I think this is just a fight. For, if I remember. If I remember correctly, of course. Um. Okay. Vegeta has reached his full power, but Raccoon is stronger still. Huh. <sighs> Is that tiny thing your best attack? Time to lost. Vegeta can't fight any longer. If he lost, we'll be next. There's no choice. Gohan, charge! Huh? Sure. Okay. Let me let me change up my deck for this. Um. All right. Uh, um. Oh, hang on. Can we? Hang on. We might be able to do something pretty cool. Can we put... Now this would be a really huge game. Can we put... No. We cannot put D-Day on, on our limit. So we cannot have Dinday anytime we want. That is unfortunate. I'll get rid of a continuous punch to put Dinday on there. Okay, there we go. That'll help. Um, I really don't like Continuous Punch, um, because again, Yajirobe is just a better Continuous Punch. Because Chiaotzu is like, it depends on the fight, really, whether they're faster or not. It's only 60% accurate, you know what? We'll take this out. The scouter is 90% accurate, and it'll help me do more damage. How much does it cost? Five? It's not terrible. It's not terrible. Okay. 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 That's pretty good. Okay. I'm not going to do this fight. We're going to stop here. Okay. So yeah, that was Dragon Ball... See legendary super warriors. The legendary warrior of space. Uh, let me make sure all of my finagling of the background didn't fuck up stuff. I don't think it did. I think we're okay. All right. See, I only I only lost one time. And that was against Nappa. Yeah. So that's pretty good. And the AI has not really been mean. They haven't busted out just random, I'm going to block your attack. I'm just going to randomly guess you're going to use an attack right now. Which they usually do. I'm sure it will happen, though. It's inevitable. That's just how this game is. But for right now, it's been relatively nice to me. Which is, which is good. So, we appreciate that. It also means I have to do less editing. Because I think I can leave that one loss, that one loss in there. Like, that's not too bad. Yeah. Okay. Going well. Good. And the translation again. Amazing. <sighs> Alright. So yeah, that's going to do it for right now. So uh, hopefully you enjoyed this, because this is a longer game. It's not that long. It's not that, that long. It'll take me a couple of sessions of recording to beat it, but like, nothing that bad. So, yeah. Unless I hit a wall, in which course, you know, then that'll be just terrible, but hmm, what are you going to do, huh? Yeah, hope you enjoyed watching. Uh, it's just going to be more of this in the future. Uh, maybe I'll work in, like, Hades or something. Again, as I said on my other videos, um, if you have any suggestions or any ideas, stuff to do, um, appreciate just letting me know. 
Again, if you just have any ideas, let me know. I will take them into consideration. I would appreciate it. So yeah, thanks for watching. And hopefully you'll join me for the next uh, session of this game, because when you're not losing every other every other match, it's not a terrible game. It could be kind of fun. Yeah. Isn't that weird? Hang on, wait, can I do this? No, I can't. Or wait, hang on. Am I? No, okay. Okay, whatever. Alright, I was checking to see, because I remember on the old Game Boy Advance, you could use um, R and L to make the game widescreen or not. I was going to keep it like this because I, you know, I designed the fucking border for it, so. But uh, I guess you can't do it on, uh, on my totally legit Game Boy Color that I'm playing this on. Okay. Alright, so yeah, that'll do it. So I hope you enjoyed watching, hope you join me next time, so until then, I guess I will see ya.